Hi, I'm Ravina and welcome to my kitchen. Today I'm going to show you how to make dal. Dal in Punjabi means lentil. So this is an Indian lentil soup. It's full of amazing spices and I know that you're going to love it. So to start off, I have a large pan and into it I'm going to put three tablespoons of oil. Do you like how I'm using a pitcher and I deliberately avoided using this bout? So three tablespoons of oil. And into it, I'm going to put some spices. Two teaspoons black mustard seeds, two teaspoons cumin seed, one teaspoon coriander seed, and one teaspoon nigella seeds, also known as kalunji. I'm putting my pot onto the stove, and that's over medium heat. And what we're gonna do is wait for the spices to start popping, and they're gonna let off the most incredible smell, and then we'll know to add our onion. We're gonna put that in, give everything a stir, and let it cook for two to three minutes until the onion is softened. Then I'm going to add my garlic and ginger. And I have two tablespoons of each, and I've just minced them and they're gonna go in and we're gonna give that a stir and let that cook for another two to three minutes as well. Now it's time to add my second batch of spices. So I have two teaspoons turmeric, two teaspoons garam masala, two teaspoons curry powder, a quarter teaspoon chili, and three tablespoons tomato paste. And once these have been cooking for two minutes, you'll see that they suck up all the liquid which the onions, the garlic, and the ginger have let out, and the pan will be really dry. So immediately, we're going to add two cups of red lentils, which I've put into a strainer and rinsed until the water that came out run clear. And I'm going to add that along with nine cups of water. We're going to cover the pot with a lid, turn the heat up, bring it to a boil, and then turn it down to a low heat in order for the mixture to simmer for 40 minutes or until everything is perfectly cooked through. And then we're going to season the soup up together. I know there's been enough seasoning already, but we're going to finish it up and it'll be amazing. My soup smells amazing. It cooked for 40 minutes and we're ready to season it. The first thing that I want to do is give it a good whoosh. Um, this is a hand immersion blender and I personally like my soup with some bigger pieces and some smaller pieces. This also is great because you're gonna break up the whole spices which are in here. So the black mustard seed, the cumin seed, the nigella seed, and it'll break them up and really help them get immersed into the flavor of the soup. So I like to do that, but this is optional. And if you want, you can also do this in batches in a blender. The soup might look a bit thin at this stage, but as it cools, it will thicken. And I'm now adding the juice of a lemon to the soup. I've already done half, and I'm onto the other half. And if you squeeze your lemon over your hands, you'll be sure to catch any pips that fall out. And then we're just going to season it with salt. And remember, we haven't added any salt to the soup yet, because if you add salt to legumes, so the lentils in this case, before they cook, the skin will toughen and they'll never dissolve properly. So you do not want to do that before the lentils are cooked and it's time to do it now. And you are going to need a fair amount of salt for this soup to taste delicious, but you know, do that to your taste, whatever, whatever you think is good is right for you. That's awesome. It's such a warm, comforting soup and there's something about Indian spices where you're not ever exactly sure what it is you're tasting. Rather, it's like your entire palate is being hit with these different notes and it's awesome and I hope you give this a try because it's incredibly easy and perfect for the winter and also should you feel the need to check out more Indian recipes on this awesome show called Ravina's Kitchen, you can check out my naan recipe and my Indian sweet potato latkes and I'll put the links to both of those at the end of the video as well as in the description box down below. I hope you give this a shot. I can't wait to hear what you think in the comments down below. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe, pass it on to all your friends, and I look forward to seeing you next Thursday. Thank you for watching. Bye.